What's up YouTube, this is LDS Reliance. Today I wanted to do an experiment and see how much power I could restore on my solar panel system by cleaning the solar panels. But before we begin, a little disclaimer. I know this is not going to be the most scientific test. There's going to be liberties taken and there's, there may be some variables introduced into the mix that don't make the data exact. But I'm going to do the best that I can and I think that this will be eye-opening for some of us. Okay, so how we're gonna test this today, if you've seen my solar shed redo series, you've seen the production of this system and what it has been able to do over the past couple of weeks since I've got it finished. The highest that I've ever seen this system go, and I, I check fairly regularly because I'm, I'm pretty curious at this point, but I've, the highest I've seen it go is about 421 watts at very peak uh, time of day. So what we're going to do is I'm going to go ahead and clean my solar panels the best that I can. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to get up on a ladder. I'm going to shoot these off with high pressure water. I'm going to um, get some soap on a broom and, and clean these off the best that I can. And then we'll monitor this throughout the day and see what the highest production number is. It is a beautiful day outside with bright uh, clear skies. So we should have a good day to test this. So let's go ahead and get started. So while I'm up here, uh, a lot of you may ha not have seen my solar panel system. Um, so just briefly, these are four DM solar, solar panels. Um, two of them are 158 watt panels and two of them are 145 watt panels. And the only reason for that is because by the time I got around to buying a second set of the 145 watt panels, uh, they were out of production basically and they were replaced with these 158 uh, watt units. So right around 600 watts production, probably slightly less because um, they're in series parallel and so they'll, they'll knock down to the 145 watt level and that's okay. Anyway, just thought I'd show you. It's rare that I get up on a ladder and, and take a look at my system and so just thought that I would show this off to you. Okay, so here's the good news. It's only 1130 and we're already up to 438 watts. So it's already made a difference. I'm gonna watch it throughout the day off and on and try to get as, as good of a sample size as I can of the highest peak uh, production and then we'll try to convert that to a percentage and see uh, what kind of difference that made. Okay, so what we just saw, it got up to 495 watts, which is the highest that I've seen it go to this point. Uh, it may have eclipsed 500 at some point. I don't know. I haven't been standing here watching it the entire time. But 495 is, is outstanding. That's a lot higher than I thought it would be. Um, I was even thinking 10% would be a fantastic uh, boost, but that's well above 10%. So according to my math, that's 17.85% boost if you go from 420 watts to 495 watts. So that's well worth doing. Uh, hopefully you guys have learned something. I know I have. I had no idea it was that good. I will definitely be cleaning these things more often. Thanks for watching, guys. We'll see you next time. For more solar panel videos in the future, hit subscribe.